I always liked seeing small golden details, on a cafe racer machine. But big golden surfaces, usually become too flashy. I don't know why, but this Ducati, seems to walk by a different path. Just like in architecture, the best way to hide structural elements, is exaggerating them. And this project is one of these examples. I was quite surprised after knowing that this isn't the work, of a pro builder. It was built by a common, cafe racer enthusiast, just like us. And this proves, what Paula Cher said. The best way to accomplish serious design, is to be totally, and completely unqualified for the job. Welcome, to Racer TV. The name of this Ducati, is Folia, which means, madness. Very appropriate. Don't you think? This beautiful bike, was built by Marco One Percenter. He is a restaurant manager in Verona, Italy. Who would think, that someone surrounded by gastronomic delights and hot waitresses, could make such a nice metallic dinner. This golden color, is definitely the piece of resistance. It isn't as rare as you may think. But having a nice and realistic golden finish, is. Most attempts to create a gold finish, end up in a strange brown. This frame, swinging arm and several details, were polished and copper plated. You really weren't expecting it to be gold. Do you? And now you're asking yourself, what about the golden stripes? That's a very good question. You really are doomed. Amazingly, the pinstriping was made with copper leaf. This, is the bike in the beginning of the project. A 2002 Ducati Monster S4. The gas tank, came from the Sport Classic model. The tail was borrowed from a 750 SS, which is very well combined, with the Arv on top fairing. The front fender and the foot pegs are custom made, just as the exhaust using laser mufflers. So, was this work of art created for an exposition? No. This is Marco's bike and he rides it every day to work. How cool is that? Thank you, for watching Racer TV. And as always, I hope to see you next week.